Hey, honey. What's for breakfast this morning? Nigga, please. Hey, can't you just tell me what's for breakfast? My nigga, please. Corey is not a supremacist. He just acknowledges racial differences. My nigga, please. America was founded by whites. Oh, right. My nigga, please. He just thinks there are suppressed truths about race. My nigga, please. America was founded. By whites, whites. The whole thing of like, you know, people, you know, claiming that, oh, well, then what are you doing in America? Because, you know, that wasn't your homeland, et cetera, et cetera. And we conquered America. We came, we had the ability, and we did it. The better man wins. That's how it works. And, you know, it's... That's also how evolution works. Exactly. Whereas in Africa, it's literally like the viol most violent man gets the most women, you know, in these kind of situations. Um, so they just have not evolved in a same way that we have. Nigga, please! We, we developed these, you know, complex societies, these, the great architecture, the great artwork, the great music, the science, the literature, etc, 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 etc. Not to Me mention the wheel. Yeah, meanwhile, our counterparts in other countries were living in mud huts and carrying baskets on their head. Nigga, please! Yeah, so again, that's a straw man. They don't believe that civilization is white only, they believe that it is high IQ only. And Eisel, you would know this if you actually listened to what the alt-right has to say. Now, obviously, this view is true in a sense. Once the average IQ is low enough, it would obviously be impossible for that group to have any kind of advanced civilization. Like, I mean, a group of mentally retarded people could not maintain an advanced civilization. Now, Corey does actually hold the view, I was pretty surprised by this, but he does believe that black people cannot produce advanced civilization. Now, I think that that is probably wrong. I don't think that the IQ is actually sufficiently lower than other groups for that to be true. But, you know, every time he tells me this, he makes a point of saying, I don't hold anything against them. I don't want to do anything bad to them. I just genuinely believe this to be a fact based on their average IQ. Did anyone see Fetto's little little artwork piece of Swayze? Yeah, um, I don't know. I'm not a fan of that. Just oh, gonna... yeah. I thought it was funny. Why aren't you a fan of it? I don't know. I just I feel bad for Swayze because she's making herself up to be an idiot. It's just like, why are you doing this to yourself? But surely she deserves it. That's literally, it's yeah, just her opinion. It's like, you're wrong, you're wrong. I don't debate racists. It's like, that's actually the shit she's saying. A potential solution for people who are or are starting to become MGTOWs and nationalists at the same time, it may be time to start thinking about either adopting a kid of your own race or having a surrogate child. That way you don't have to deal with marriage and women and you'll be able to instill your ideas in your kids and continue your own race. So I'll be back in a few. I gotta go read 10 more pages of Mein Kampf. Not much, I just finished the chapter on propaganda. Yes, it's very, it's very usable for veganism as well. We need to be make all vegans become propagandists. Think of the lowest intellectual common denominator and appeal to that kind. Hey guys, all right, so I found out who hacked my Discord. Jack was in fact involved in this and did it intentionally. If you asked me about him a day or two ago, I would have said, yeah, he's a great guy. I mean, his political views are different, but go check out his channel. I have, however, removed my videos and social media posts from public visibility. 
My channel and my social media portals, as they stood before this content removal, contained plenty of the type of content that would make mainstream outlets reluctant to have me on. Let me give you some advice, bastard. Never forget what you are. The rest of the world will not. Wear it like armor, and it can never be used to hedge. But so, yeah, no hard feelings, but you should defend or retract and change your position.